Good morning, folks. It was a calm 24 hours on the Earth-facing disk. A small surface surge close to a departing filament appeared like it might get things going, but alas, silence prevails. We have three plasma filaments dancing in on the southeastern limb. Tonight, the first one will be facing Earth, another released a few hours ago behind the limb. So when we come to spaceweathernews.com, we find solar flaring still struggling, barely see class range. And the sunspots are unlikely to change that, one group only worth watching. And the spread side to side of magnetism remains as well. Folks, as expected, the CME struck Earth's magnetic field yesterday afternoon. It was not very dense or fast, a glancing blow. But even without geomagnetic storms produced, we can see the energetic disruption to our magnetosphere and the slice it took at the electron flux. Folks, we've got a northern positive coronal hole coming in along with the southern polar extension up from its coronal hole. With the planets still bunched in the morning sky, we are also seeing geomagnetic and tropical mitigation factors waning. And so over at QuakeWatch.net, we've taken the watch level up from moderate to elevated. The only storm development of note is in the Indian Ocean. Twin systems, still weak. We're seeing Olaf weaken slowly as he curls north and then northeast. These are the scenes in Texas. Unfortunately, these are far more numerous than pictures of Patricia's far more deadly landfall in Mexico. Flooding here is expected to get worse today, however, as the rains won't be stopping, but they will be moving into the southeast while another system takes on the northwest. Big low in the North Atlantic. Even with heavy rains lingering in the far eastern Mediterranean, the winds off this northern system could end up being damaging. Down under, you see the low pressure entering Australia from the southeast, and we're going to find moisture funneled into western Australia and at the convergence line between nations. Folks, yesterday's episode of Fly on the Wall was a good one. Over an hour of audio, plus episode 84 of Deeper Look has been posted. The book release is coming soon as well. We appreciate all the support from our membership. Thank you all very much. We've got your current conditions and shots of our star to close. It's 6.30 a.m. Eastern Time, and that's the news. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.